The topic of this video is going to be how do I log in into OpenBox or into XFCE or i3 automatically and also how to auto login. So these two things are covered in this video and the word you need to remember is two words actually. LightDM is an important word and auto login. When you start looking on the websites, because we have different ways to help you, articlinux.com, and if you search here auto login, you'll find a lot of documentation here about auto login. But in this case, it's more about um, this is a good one how to set Arch Linux to boot into OpenBox or i3 rather than XFCE, right? But these guys, the other guys, are about dual booting with Windows. This one is again a very good one how to auto login into your Plasma desktop because the procedure I'm going to explain in this video, which is going to be a concentrated video just about auto login and about a light DM, it's always the same procedure. Whatever Plasma, um, desktop you're on, Plasma desktop or Cinnamon or Mate or Awesome or BSP WM or 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 or. We have 12 desktops now. So it's if you once you know it, it's so simple. And it's actually already explained in this, this article, this video, and in this image we see right here. Again, there is an Arc Linux B ISO, and there as well we explain you what to do um, if you want to auto login. And let's me open just one here. Every article that's in here, Arc Linux B, every one of those and every one of those have a article uh, here and, and a text that says to you look if you want to add a login change etc lightm lightm.conf out login session your desktop what is my desktop i look up here and i say my desktop is budgie so i replace uh, whatever is in there with budgie and where can i find the naming for desktop well in the article in the name in the iso you downloaded but also here so now that's the information, it is out there, and this video is going to be added to um, these uh, articles here. Let's now do it together. So they say you have an information folder user share X sessions. This is Arch Linux, meaning XFC OpenBox i3. Two questions. One is I want to boot up with OpenBox rather than XFC or i3. And the other is how to auto login. So if you want to know what to type, then it's always going to be in user share accessions. Cinnamon, Mate, Awesome, BSP, WM, these will have a desktop file there. What you need to do, let's get rid of this one, what you need to do in every single Arch Linux, Arch Linux D, Arch Linux B, is go to etc lightdm, lightdm.conf, open it up with Sublime Text, that's the best possible way to do it. Unfortunately, it's already set to Perl. Normally, you see this. That's not helpful. Go to plain text here at the bottom right. Change it to Perl. And now I'm telling you the following uh, thing. Everything that's black is not used. And everything that's white is used. If you want to boot up next time with not XFC, because that's the normal uh, word here. Normal, normally, it says XFCE. You want to boot up next time with OpenBox, auto login. So you see already some changes here. We've changed this. We don't want to auto login. Done. No auto login anymore. Or we do want to auto login and not XFC. Let's try i3 this time. Like so. Who's going to log in? Eric is going to log in. And um, the user session is going to be i3. That's all you need to do. Change the relevant uh, elements and then save, Control S. And next time when you reboot, in this case, what I've done is say, Eric, you can auto login and it's going to be i3 and I'll never see my, my choice, my light DM, if I want to have OpenBox or XFC. No, I just go inside i3 when I boot up. So that's what you need to know. That's the same information at all in all the Arch Linux versions, being Arch Linux D, being Arch Linux um, 
B, D, B, doesn't matter. All Alkalinux to work with LightGM and work with the same file. So you need to change it. And why is that? Because Alkalinux B, for instance, let's have a look here. Alkalinux B is, um, let me put up a website first. So I put up uh, two more websites, which is the GitHub Alkalinux D. So when we are working, this one is Arco Linux ISO, Openbox XFC i3. When you do an installation of Linux D ISO, you get scripts in. And just taking the first one here, it says here 800 auto login. Rather than doing what I did manually, we have a script that says, what's your name? Ah, oh, it's Eric. Okay. Then we're going to add Eric to the users of auto login. And then we're going to change this line into auto login user Eric. And auto login session, which is empty, which has a hashtag in front, is going to be changed in auto login session xmonad. Simple as that. We don't need to go into the same procedure that we've done manually now. We do not need to go to etclightdm.conf. The script does it for us and we're auto logged in. And every, every single article in XD, let's take another one, has a script like that. Auto login. The difference is only the name, open box, and of course your username. So that's basically um, that simple in Arclinux D. Now the Arclinux B, we have seen that in Ar every Arclinux B you need to do it yourself. If you want to auto login, you need to change it yourself. Every single uh, one of these guys is going to mention that you need to do it yourself. You need to change this. There's only two one, two only one actually, that you don't have to change it and that's XFCE because standard, and now, it, now it's gonna hit you probably. If you go and have a look at the Article Linux B scripts, what we do is we build upon the Article Linux ISO. We are going to say, get me Article Linux ISO. And what does this one say? It says auto login XFCE. So the data comes from Arclinux ISO. You are building an Arclinux B cinnamon, but it will keep saying auto login XFCE. And that's why you need to change it. You need to go manually inside to change one word into another word, and then you're up and running again. I hope that's uh, concentrated information about auto login. Once you know it's super simple, and I'll post this, this information on all three websites. All right, cheers.